Moin sind Leute, heißt Kommen zu Let's Play. Wir sind gerade wieder zurück im äh, Krankenhaus. Oh. Shit. Ja, okay, gut, wir sind gerade auf der Pennersuche. Dann bleiben ja nur noch ähm, Kirche, Friedhof, botanische Anlage und eventuell der Knast. Ich will schon mal auf den Fluss Kirche. Ja, da ist er ja. Hello again, Goober. You again? Are you stalking me, girl? Ja. You pop up everywhere I go. I'll try to tone down the charm, but I can't promise anything. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, you're quite the charmer. I know. I just said that, man. Listen, I feel kind of bad about the electrocution. Oh, that's what it was. What a cherry on top of my stellar performance. <laughs> yeah, it was uh, pretty convincing. So what brings you to the house of God? Come to repent? Uh, I'm afraid that ship has long since sailed, buddy. I had a few things I wanted to ask you about, though. Shoot, Missy. Um, Franklin Goldfarb. Your real name is Franklin Goldfarb, right? Oh, nobody calls me that. Regardless, I know for a fact that you were a witness to a burglary a few years back at the Wade Estate. Yeah, what about it? Why don't you tell me what you saw exactly? I heard the alarm go off, glass break, and then I saw three guys running away, carrying a bunch of stuff. What did they look like? It was dark. I don't know. They were definitely three big, bulky guys. They, uh... They what? Oh, nothing. That's it. Didn't see anything else. Mm -hmm. Bullshit. Spit it out. Well, one of those guys dropped his ring when running away. I sort of pawned it. A ring? What kind of ring? Platinum with an inscription. Two letters. B... something. Man, I don't remember. My photographic memory stopped working in 1979. Which pawn shop was that? Pete's Pawning and Plumbing. It closed down a long time ago, though. Owner left town. There's a coffee shop back there now. Hmm. Too bad. Guess that's a dead end. Thanks anyway. Didn't I see two letters fitting that description recently? Not on a building. It was something small. Apitas. <gasps> Did the inscription on the ring look anything no. like this? Wow, actually exactly like that. Any idea what BH stands for? BA, Büßen halten. Ach so, ja. Das... Tja. That's all for now. See ya. See ya, sucker. Hello, Isaac. I'm only... Uh, Do you know I don't reckon Okay. Do you know I have just a vague hmm. Do you know what BH means? I'm sorry. That's all I need for now. May the Lord shine his light on you. Uh, BP will be the price. <sighs> Oma. Oma ist das dein Feuerzeug, beziehungsweise von Opa, dann solltest du vielleicht auch wissen, wofür BH steht. Ja, 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 Wüstenhalter ist es nicht. Mind if we talk for not at all to BH? Do you recognize the acronym BH? It's on Dad's lighter. Yes, dear, it means the black hats. They're those ruffians on motorcycles whom your father associated with. Oh. Oh, his biker gang. That makes sense. The black hats. What can you tell me about the black hats? I refuse to talk so about man those hoodlums. They turned your father into a horrible person. You should stay far away from them, Kathy. They're awful people, just awful. Vielen Dank für diese wundervolle Information. Vielleicht finde ich ein Polizeirevier, ja, was zu denen. Dann haben die wahrscheinlich die Bilder geklaut. Ich frage mich, ob mein Vater dann auch da irgendwie mit bei war. You know what I mean? Bullerei. 
Moin, Lenny, ich muss immer wieder auf den Sack gehen. Zuckerschnude. Hey, Lenny. Hallo, Kathy. Den BH gibt's. What can you tell me about? They've caused us trouble from time to time, but they've been kind of quiet lately. We put a few of their captains in the slammer over the years, but we never managed to find enough dirt on their leader. Bo Brunson. Big Bo. Do you know where I can find them? Yeah, hold on. Let me just find a map. And so? Got it. Thanks. Well, gotta go. See ya. Krass. Der denkt sich auch nichts dabei. Hm, ja, du möchtest da so einer gefährlichen Beinkrim begegnen. Und dann, dann gehst du da einfach hin. Hier ist die Karte. Denkt man sich auch noch so, was? Alles klar, dann werden wir auf dem Bike. Ja, wir wissen ja, dass Frauen im biker äh, da richtig schön equal angesehen sind. Nämlich nicht. Sweet bud incoming! Like hell I am, I am nobody's property. You sure? Doesn't she look like a sweet butt? Little slut? I think she does. Schau dir gleich auf die Fresse, Junge. Step off, creep. Or what? You tell your daddy on me? Digga, ich breche dir die Nase, du Hurensohn. Oder kannst deine Eier vom Boden abkratzen, du verfluchtes Schwein. Glaubst du wirklich, ich bräuchte meinen Daddy, um die Schwäche in den Arsch zu treten? So, das besser schnell dazu lernen. Arschloch, verpiss dich aber schnell. Or you'll be scraping your balls off the floor, you fucking pig. Oh, I love it when they play hard to get. Let go of me! No time for that now. Ja, ich würde ihm gerne. Let me go! She's got a temper, this one. Ja, ich würde gerne hier den Taser benutzen. Zip. Spast. What the hell's going on out here? Nothing, Prez. Just having a bit of fun with this gash here. I suggest you leash that dog of yours. For fuck's sake, Prospect. Not again. Get the hell out of here. Sorry, boss. I'll go. Fuck. That hurt you, cunt. Selber schuld, du Pissgesicht. Dreckige Hohensohn, Alter. Danke. Discipline for that. He better be. I take it your bow? I am. And who are you, darling? Kathy Rain. Bullshit. She lives in the city with her deranged mother. Who are you, really? Did the Vandal send you? No, they didn't. I am Kathy Rain. Prove it, then. Soll ich meine ID zeigen? I would, but I left my ID back home. That's convenient. I think I've wasted enough time with you. I need to figure out some proof. Ah, brauche ich jetzt ernsthaft was von mir? Ah, fuck it. Okay, das kann ich ihm nicht geben, oder? That won't convince him. This proof enough for you? I'll be damned. That's Brian's lighter. Get off. Sorry about the paranoia. We've had some problems with the vandals lately. I get it. Can't be too careful. So that's your ride out there. Corley Motors, right? 78? Yep. 76. Trust, okay. You got the same taste as your old man. He always rode Corleys. Probably the only thing he and I have in common. Did you set up those mods yourself? Looks custom made for your small frame. Yeah, took some time to get the measurements right. I imagine so. Girls like you don't often ride heavy bikes. I'm not most girls. Ain't that the truth. Most girls don't just waltz into places like this either. I guess you'd know. Anyway, I had some questions for you in the club. Go ahead then. Your old man was a good brother, so I'll indulge it for now. Wo fang ich an? Bisschen über die Black Hats. What can you tell me about the Black Hats? Black Hats MC was founded in the 60s by my old man, my uncle, and two other local bikers. Conwell Springs is the mother chapter, and we have support clubs in six other locations across three states. There's a total of 16 members here, 12 patch, four prospects. I'm the acting president of this chapter, as well as of the whole club. I've been for more than 15 years. The law give you any trouble? It used to be tough when your granddad was around. He and Truman ran a tight ship. And now? Now they try, but Boyks and the boy are a nuisance at best. Okay. 
Do you know anything about what happened to Joseph Rain in 1981? No. We had our differences, me and him, but that's a horrible fate for a man. I'd rather be dead than a vegetable. So I take it you and him didn't get along? No, I could write a book about that man. On one page, I'd praise him. On the next, I'd want to smash his skull in. He could be a real self-righteous prick when he wanted to, that's for sure. But everyone knew he was the real law around here. Truman was a tool. I respected Joseph, and he respected me. But he hated how Brian looked up to me. Joseph always blamed the club for the path Brian chose in life. Even though it was just due to him being a shitty father. Okay. Yes, but you know. You seriously thought Grandpa was a bad parent? Everybody knew about it. People just tend to forget the bad qualities of men in wheelchairs. <laughs> Joseph wasn't a saint. He saw everything black and white. He was only kind to whomever he considered to be good by his narrow moral standards. The ones who wouldn't fit in that small mold didn't get any chances. None whatsoever. Okay. Do you know anything about Lily Myers? Nothing that anyone else around here couldn't tell you. Do you know who Jimmy Cochran is? No. Okay. Tell me, how long have you been the president of this club? Fifteen years now, give or take. And VP for ten before that. Good. Then you can tell me why you stole Lily Myers' paintings from Charles Wade in 86. I don't know what the hell you're talking about, but I'd recommend you be careful with wild accusations like that. Ähm, oder hast du muss ich was das war in Ordnung das was was ich für den Club tun kann um dann Vertrauen zu erlangen. Fine. Is there anything I can do for the club to earn your trust? Du musst mit den Leuten halt schon so ein bisschen. Oh fuck. I think we got that covered cupcake. Ja, du bist mit Wanda. Spare me your sexist bullshit. I can take care of business. You're nothing like your old man. You know that? I take that as a compliment. You do that. In any case, I've had enough of this nonsense. Stop pushing your luck. Hmm. What can you tell me? Do I look like a pious man to you? Yeah. I've peed on churches. Okay. This may be a weird question, but have you ever met a bald man dressed in red? I've made a few bald men red. That count? Yeah, can John. Any idea of what the you ask weird nicht. question? Ja, 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 ja. Ah, I don't need to. Nee. Das Kette braucht er auch nicht. Do you know what this is? Whoa. Whoa, heißt? What? Do you recognize Wahrscheinlich that? nicht. I saw one of those with my own eyes a few years ago. Really? Where? Middle of the woods, the road of the city. Those things came from nowhere and gave me this crazy headache right on the plate in my head. At the time, I thought it was just a nasty case of migraine. You have a plate in your head? Yeah, titanium from a shrapnel wound I got in there. Oh, I see. Titanium isn't the least bit magnetic, is it? How the hell should I know? I'm no scientist. Do you remember where exactly on the road it happened? No. Like I said, I dismissed it as a migraine. Didn't pay too much attention as to where I was. Fair mm -hmm. enough. I don't need to show. No. Do you know any? Do I look like a florist to you? Uh, yeah, so I do. A little bit. <laughs> Crack me up, girl. Hmm. I, I already showed that. I don't have an ex. I don't need. Ne, okay. All right, I'm gonna hit the road. Right on. I have some business to take care of, but make yourself at home. Thanks, Bo. See you around. Hey, Brian's girl. Yeah. I overheard you. I'm Emmett. Zufällig, ja, mon Emmett. The boss man isn't usually that grumpy. He's got a lot on his mind. Also, ich will was ich think I may know of a way to loosen him up. I'm all ears, buddy. Well, Bo and Brian are the double B's, as we used to call them. <laughs> They used to have this drink together. Brian came up with it. He called it a bloodier Mary. Hmm, sounds like my kind of drink. Yeah, it's basically a Bloody Mary, but with pig blood instead of Ew. tomato juice. I take that back. Gross. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's just a Bloody Mary, but with a special ingredient added to it. 
If you say that special ingredient is blood, I will literally punch you. <laughs> no. Brian refused to tell anyone what it was. He only made it for special occasions. It's probably something uncommon, like a rare herb or some kind of expensive spice. Mm -hmm. So let me guess. If I can produce this drink for Bo, you think he would help me out? It'll make him remember Brian, which should go a long way. He hasn't had that drink since your old man disappeared. Brian was like a son to him. The boss would have died for him back in the day. If you could recall the good times with your father, he might change his mind. I guess it could be worth a try. Wait, why are you helping me? You're Brian's kid. That means you're family. We take care of family. Well, how was that drink compared with the regular Bloody Mary? Tasted a bit more like pepper and had a punch to it. It usually gave some pretty nasty hangovers. Oh, if you had a lot of them, you'd hallucinate some crazy shit. Pretty wild. Trippy. Thanks. You're welcome, darling. Er will das Zeug wieder saufen. Ja gut, dann würde ich mal einfach an dieser Stelle ein paar Bänden. Und wir sehen uns beim nächsten Mal wieder. Ich wünsche Spaß und Ruhe.